And welcome back to the Moldy Worm Gaming Channel. My name is Moldy Worm41975, and I know you've all been asking for me to do some more farming sim let's play. It is coming. Um, I've just been moving home from university. I have had a lot of um, unfinished sort of coursework that I needed to get sorted out. Uh, I'm still working through that, um, but it's it's mostly there now. Um, so the farming sim content is coming back. I promise. Um, I also want to say that this whole setup I have going on now, I'm using a really crappy light. I'm planning on getting a proper like face halo light. So hopefully the next sort of video I do like this, the lighting will be a little bit better. But I'm sure for this video, we can just put up with that. And also behind me here, um, I am going to have a green screen Um you might remember that some of the farming sim videos I did while I was at university, I was actually using a university loaned green screen. Um, I didn't have my own at that point. But I wanted to bring you guys something other than the Forza Rally series, which I've been doing for a few weeks now. And um, before I actually left university, I made um, an episode of Would You Rather? And you guys seem to really enjoy watching that. It's uh, got quite a lot of views. So I thought I would do another one. So this is actually episode three of Would You Rather. Um, I made an episode a few years ago and then I made one about a month ago. And this is actually episode three. So a lot of YouTubers have done this. Let's just get straight into it. Um, so the first question, taste the same flavor of food or never taste anything again. Um, so I'm guessing this means that whatever you eat, it all just tastes like one thing, so it all tastes like caramel, or it all tastes like vanilla, or something, um, or never taste anything again. I'm thinking, right, if, if everything tastes the same, then surely it also doesn't taste of anything, because if everything tastes the same, it, it just tastes, you, you know, you, you can't distinguish between the different tastes, so technically it would still taste of nothing. So basically... This is all both the same question. So would I rather, I'd rather have some flavor. So I'm going to go with this one. 81% of people agree with me on that one. So I think we got that one right. Would you rather change your religion or change your political party? I'm not a religious person. Uh, I'm actually an atheist. Um, so change my religion i guess i'd just pick a religion or change my political party um i'm also not politically minded at all i don't really have a political party so this is actually a really bad question for me because i'm not really religious and i'm not um very political either so i guess i'll go change my political party yeah it's it's a relatively even split on that. 60-30, yeah. Um, okay. Would you rather always look eight months pregnant or always have a black eye? Ooh. I mean, I'm a guy, so if I looked eight months pregnant, I'm not sure how that would work. Does it Does it mean that I actually look pregnant or does it mean that I look or I, I'm just fat? Because as a guy, I can't obviously get pregnant. Um, but always having a black eye. If you're a guy and you look pregnant, then you are just fat. People aren't going to question that as much because they can see it. If you have a black eye, people are going to come up and ask, are you alright and whatever. So I'm going to go eight months pregnant. People would rather have a black eye? Really? Um, would you rather actually have to laugh out loud every time you type lol? Ha ha, laughing my ass off, or anything close to that, okay. Or would you always have to replicate the face of any emoticon you use? Oh, imagine that. Every time you type an emoji, you actually had to make the face of the emoji that you were doing. Because some of the emojis are really messed up. Like, the smiling one's really obvious. 
Um, but some of the other emojis, like when you're throwing up and stuff, um, would that mean you actually have to throw up? I mean, this one, when you type like lol and haha and you actually have to laugh out loud, I do that anyway. <laughs> it's not great, so I'm going to go with that one. Yeah, a pretty even split actually, but so far we've been we've been right on the money with all of them. Um, we're, we're with the majority. Okay, this is this is a good one. Um, I like these simple ones. Would you rather lose both your arms or lose both your legs? I'm gonna go with both your legs because if you lose both your arms, you can't you can't well you can pick stuff up with your feet and learn how to do that, but it's a lot harder. Um, you could always have a prosthetic leg. And I know there's people now saying, oh, but you can have a prosthetic arm. That's true, um, but prosthetic legs have been around for a lot longer. Um, it's a lot easier, I think. So losing both your legs, okay, you can't walk around, but you can be in a wheelchair. You can still pick stuff up. You can still play with a games controller. Remember, if you lose your arms, you're losing, losing your hands as well. So you can't type on a keyboard. You can't use a controller anything like that losing your legs yes you can't walk around you can't do sport etc but you can have prosthetic legs you could always be in a wheelchair and yeah most people agree with me on that one so would you rather be a manly woman or a womanly man i mean i am a man right now i wouldn't say i'm a womanly man i'm gonna go with womanly man yeah, very, very even split. That's the first one we're not with the majority of people. But, yeah. I, I think it just comes down to whether you are a guy or a girl with that one, honestly. Um, I'm a guy, so I chose the guy one. But, yeah. Would you rather eat a rotten raw steak, okay? Eat a human's cooked liver. Uh, I'm going to go human cooked liver just because it's cooked. You're not going to get ill from it. Okay, yes, it is cannibalism. Um, but it's cooked. It's more, you know, you're not going to get sick from it. I mean, it's pretty even split again, but the majority says eat a human cooked liver. I'm guessing it's a human that's already died. Or I'm guessing. I don't know. Are we killing a, are we killing a person uh, to eat their liver? I don't know. I hope not. Um, let's go to the next one. Would you rather have a huge head and a small neck or have a huge neck with a small head? So if you have a huge head and a small neck, it means you've got a big heavy head sat on a very small weak neck, which is going to give you a lot of neck pain. If you've got a huge neck, you've got a big strong neck, it looks a bit weird, and a small head, I think that's going to be the way to go. Really? Peace? That's okay. I was not expecting that. I don't know whether people haven't thought this one through properly, but yeah, that's my theory. You've, you've got a lightweight, small head on a big neck. Would you rather fight a bear or fight a lion? Ooh. Well, I know lions are really fast, and I, I am not fast at all. Um, I know bears are reasonably fast as well, but I think they're slower than a lion. It's saying fight them, so I guess it, I guess you don't really have the option of running away. I guess that's what that's saying. Um, there's a lot of guessing going on today. I'm sorry if I keep saying I guess, I guess. Um, but I'm trying to find loopholes in the questions. I think if you fought either one of these, um, th there'll be someone out there somewhere, oh, I fought a bear and you can easily fight a bear if you do this. I don't know how to fight a bear or a lion. Uh, so, if I fought either one of these, I'm going to die. So, I'm just trying to pick which one would end my life quicker and, and be the less, the least suffering. I don't know what a bear does when it fights you. I'm going to go with bear. A lot of people say fight a bear, yeah. I don't know what it is. I feel like a bear... Yeah, I know bears can be quite uh, vicious, but I don't think they're quite as vicious as lions. Would you rather have 2 million YouTube subscribers or have 1 million Twitter followers? 2 million YouTube subscribers. That was an easy one. <laughs> That's going to happen one day. You guys, you know, if you're not subscribed right now and you're enjoying this video, 
cheeky plug, go go subscribe down below. Would you rather be the best known person in a small band that under 200 people know or be some guy on the sidelines of your favourite band? I'm not really sure who my favourite band is. I really like ABBA. Shows how old I, I am mentally. But uh, yeah, I really like ABBA. Um, I also like the country band Alabama. I think they're really good. Um, I don't know if you class it as a band, but I also like Brooks and Dunn. Um, if you guys are country fans, then you'll know who I'm talking about. Um, so, would I like to be one of them? Well, I'm not really into, like, fame. Yes, I'd love millions of subscribers, but I'm going to give it that one. It's quite close. For a $2,000 reward, would you rather stay overnight in a haunted asylum... Or go on a scary but broken roller coaster. I'm afraid of heights and I don't mind roller coasters, but my fear is always going on one and it breaks while I'm on it, so stay in a haunted asylum. It's haunted, I believe in ghosts, so make of that what you will. Um, but I'm guessing if it's haunted, all the inmates have left, so yeah, that wouldn't bother me too much. Would you rather be Gonzo or be the Cookie Monster? Cookie Monster, because I like cookies. These ones are quite easy. Would you rather be a ninja or be a pirate? I'm guessing this is like old-fashioned pirate, you know, like wooden, like Pirates of the Caribbean, big wooden ship, you know, parrot on your shoulder, eye patch, all that kind of thing. Not like pirates these days. I mean, being a ninja, you could go around being undetected. I don't really know what ninjas do. What do they do, ninjas? Let me know in the comments. What do you think ninjas do? If you are a ninja, tell me. What do you do? Um, what do you have to put on your CV to become a ninja? <laughs> I mean, I don't watch a lot of, like, Japanese kind of programs. I don't really know much about Japanese culture. So, I, I think that's where ninjas come from. Um... I don't really know much about them. Being a pirate, I mean, like, Car Pirates of the Caribbean is, like, what I'm imagining. I'm going to go with that. Everyone wants to be a ninja. Okay, well, I guess I got that wrong. Would you rather get hit by a bus or watch someone you love get hit by a bus? Oh, oh, that's not a nice question. Um, the impact would kill the victim... You could not close your eyes or turn away. Neither of you are suicidal. I should probably have been reading this a uh, little bit down here. It gives you a little bit extra. So basically, whoever the bus hits, it does kill them, is what this person is saying. If you watch the person you love get hit by a bus... No, I'd, I'd choose for me to get hit by a bus, yeah. Less painful. I mean, physically it's painful, but yeah. Last question. Uh, would you rather drool abnormally in public or audibly moan during each conversation you have? Oh, God. And there's no social clues for this one. So would you rather drool all the time or moan all the time is basically the question. I'm trying to think which way people might actually go on this one. Moaning all the time is a little bit weird. The, the, you could be in like a job interview um, it says during each conversation you have so yeah you'd be moaning for our, like job interviews and stuff um, the drooling thing you could just okay yeah it's not it's not the best thing in the world but you could say that that's down to some kind of disorder I guess the moaning thing I guess could also be down to some kind of disorder but I'm going to go with I'm going to say that most people go with this one Yes, we got it right. We're doing a lot better with the majority, sort of getting on the majority votes than we do with uh, Google Feud. We played that a few times as well, and I am terrible at guessing the answers for that. Um, so maybe we'll do a Google Feud next week, actually. So uh, if you've enjoyed this video and you want to see some more videos like this, as well as my usual gaming content, then make sure you go subscribe below. Um, quite a lot of you watch my content, but you're not actually subscribed to the channel. So if you are enjoying it, it'd be awesome if you could subscribe. Um, it just sort of 
boosts my morale a little bit, makes me want to make some more videos for you. And uh, hopefully very soon um, I will have a green screen behind me once again. And um, I forgot what the other thing was. Oh yeah, halo light for my face. So you can all see my beautiful face again. But thanks all so much for watching guys. Hope you did enjoy and I'll see you in the next one.